Hey everybody, Pastor Paul coming at you again with another devotional. Today we're going to be looking at Mark chapter 1, verses 16 to 20. It says, As Jesus walked beside the Sea of Galilee, he saw Simon and his brother Andrew casting a net into the lake, for they were fishermen. Come follow me, Jesus said, and I will send you to fish for people. At once they left their nets and followed him. When he had gone a little farther, he saw James, son of Zebedee, and his brother John in a boat, preparing their nets, and without delay he called them. And they left their father Zebedee in the boat with the hired men and followed him. Well, what an interesting uh, picture again that we get of Jesus as he is starting out his ministry, he's calling others. He's calling the disciples as we now know them. But at this time, they were just fishermen. And what does he say to them? He says, I will make you fish for people. And we toss that around as a clever saying now. Sometimes uh, Christians often do this. But at that time, it was really not something that people would have said or that was catchy um, or clever at all. It was actually meeting these guys right where they were at. Jesus was saying to them, I'm going to use the skill that you already have for my kingdom. I'll make you fish for people. Well, it doesn't matter where you work, as long as it's not something where you're breaking the law. But in your field, in your career, in whatever it is you do, I believe that Jesus wants to use what you do and minister through you, if you will allow him, right where you're at. Well, Jesus called these guys from fishing for fish to fishing for people. And if you're watching today, I believe that he's calling you as well. And I believe that in the midst of whatever's going on in your life, that this calling, this thing that Jesus is inviting you into, is something that will use your skill, what you know, and will make it even more beautiful, even more wonderful, if you'll listen. So today, listen and ask, what is it that you're calling me to do, Lord? What do I need to do? And you'll be a fisher of men as well. We'll go in peace, make it a great day.